Hi guys, and welcome to day 22 of Elena Music Online. Um, shout outs today go to Chandler for rocking the whole idea of Mondays and using that to ask questions and get caught up and turn things in. Um, and then shout out today also goes to both Allie and Peyton, who I know were auditioning for High School Wind Ensemble today. So congratulations on completing your auditions. Good luck. Uh, to anyone else who auditioned for Wind Ensemble that I wasn't aware of, good luck and congratulations to you as well. Um, sectionals today. Yesterday went pretty well, I think, with doing our combined ensemble sectionals. I know it's a little bit weird, and probably especially for choir, it's a little bit harder because we're jumping around between different parts and hearing the harmony that you're not used to hearing. But I do think it was valuable to spend a full 30 minutes on each song. So for today, we're going to continue in the same manner. I have today, 1045, we'll start with office hours. So 1045 to 1130. 1130, we will move into hide and seek. And then at 12 o'clock, we'll move into all star. So right now, hide and seek choir, you all have that and have been working on that for a while. Orchestra, I did upload that and I said this is entirely optional. It is tough because it's a hard key signature. The rhythms are really easy for you guys. If there is anyone who is on the fence about it and really was kind of leaning towards not doing it, but maybe was debating, please come to the sectional so you can get a sense of how it's going to work. Even if you only come for five minutes and decide, yeah, this is definitely not for me, that's okay. But it'll give you a really good sense of what the timing of it's going to be, what the pitch is going to be. We will be having that sectional at the piano instead of um, like I've been doing everything else on flute. Because it is our choir feature, I want to make sure they're totally comfortable with it. So they get my voice and they get the piano pitches. And hopefully you guys can kind of fit in with it. I would really love to have some string players join us for that. So uh, moving on. For note flight, there's nothing new today. I do still need a lot more people to sign up on that spreadsheet I sent out yesterday. Again, this is only for the people who said yes on last week's survey that they would be willing to play some of these duets. But I have a lot of you who haven't filled out that survey yet and we're relying on you to play some of these duets. So the next step is going to be just to take a look at the music and practice through that so that you're ready to record. On Thursday this week, I will give you more instructions regarding how we will actually be doing the recordings. I will probably sign up for some of them as well just because it's fun and I like to play. So. Look for my name to pop up on a few of them, but I want to get as many students performing as possible is kind of the idea of the whole project anyway. So before I start taking over, I'd love for you guys to sign up for that. Uh, if there is a song on there that does not have a link yet, that's just because I'm working with the arranger to either get the, the link permissions opened or to get the, the final version submitted. So I will continue to update that spreadsheet. Feel free to sign up for ones even if they don't currently have a song title or a link, just so that we know that they have, have performers ready to help. Um, okay, so goal for today, Pops Concert. As always, yesterday you chose a song that you are going to really focus on and try to record this week. I want you to start there. So as always, practicing 15 to 30 minutes. Focus on that song, but don't be afraid to move on to other ones. So maybe you spend the first 15 minutes practicing just that song, and then you go and you do a run through of your other ones just to keep them fresh. Always filling out your journal, filling out what did you warm up with, what was the repertoire you practiced, and what is your reflection for the day to help you moving forward. Couple of things um, that I wanted to bring up that are optional, you don't have to do them, but just for those who might be either really in the mood to do more music or you're having a great time with it and you just want to keep getting better or maybe you've finished all of your other stuff and you're getting kind of bored. So for anyone who might be interested, a couple of things. I received an email from the Marine Band of the United States. So this is the Marine Band in Washington, DC. Uh, band students, you and I were doing some of the March Mania. They are the people who put that program on. They are offering free, um, free virtual master classes and clinics to anyone who's interested. So I'd love to see if we have a group of people who are interested in doing that. We'll set up a time and we'll schedule it with them. So what that'll be is they'll actually have someone from the Marine Band, a professional musician will come in and will listen to us play and listen to people ask questions. They might play for us. So if you're interested, take a look in classroom. I've put a survey there. I just wanna see if we have at least 10 people interested, then I'll go ahead and reach out to them and set that up. Uh, Try M. 
There is a National Day of Gratitude coming up on Thursday this week, April 30th. I know that doesn't give you a lot of time. However, Tri-M Nationally is doing a online social media campaign for the Day of Gratitude and in honor of frontline workers. So hospital staff, nurses, doctors, grocery store workers, everyone who's out there working during this virus and who are putting their lives on the line for us. So if you would like to participate, and this can be for anyone, but especially Tri-M, because Tri-M is the group that's putting it on, then what we're asking for you to do is come up with a rendition of Bill Withers' Lean On Me. So that song, you can make it up yourself, you can find a version online, you can sing along with a karaoke track, but now that we've done all this arranging, you could also arrange a version on Note Flight. You can find music there and learn how to play it on your instrument. You could play it with your friends and do a video like we're doing for these duets. But if you're interested, take a video of either yourself performing or of your note flight maybe that's playing, post it out on social media, so and then tag at NAFME, which is the National Association for Music Education. They're the group who run Triam. And then put the two hashtags, um, Lean on Us and Day of Gratitude and share those out. We're gonna do an online national social media campaign in order of those front, in honor of those frontline workers. So those two things optional if you would like to do them. Um, practicing for 15 to 30 minutes, see you at sectionals or office hours and have a good day.